Hey Sugar Stars, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're unboxing a mini brand's advent calendar. An advent calendar is a special calendar used to count down the days until December 25th. Every day, you open a door to reveal a special surprise inside. And today, we're unboxing this one, the toy mini brand's advent calendar. This one has 24 mini toys inside and four exclusive mini toys. I see Hello Kitty on the front, Play-Doh, Kinetic Sand. I'm excited to see what else we find. So if you're ready to unbox this with me tap the like button and let's go here is the toy mini brands advent calendar by zuru so these are only going to be toys now i've unboxed mini brands in the past not for an official video but i did do a food mini brands and i got a lot of the same thing so i'm excited for this one because it's all gonna be different toys i only got this too because hello kitty is on the front here i heard that there are several hello kitties in here maybe we'll see i mean unless this is lying to me i see hello kitty here another hello kitty here let's go ahead and open this up in three two one bam three two one bam what is this looking like let's show this camera here wow wow that's a woo. wait this one is actually really cute it's like the 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 toy shelf at the at the grocery store all the numbers are spread out like where's number one it's not up here i have to hunt for it number oh, right there wait does it tell me does it give like a little spoiler? Let's start off with box number one. We'll see if it actually is the one on the picture because that would be, that would be really oh! ah! Sorry, I apologize for that sound. Okay, we got a Hello Kitty tiny sleep mask. Oh my good. Okay, I was not expecting Hello Kitty on the first day. Um, you're gonna set me up to have high expectations, mini brands. Wow, it even has like a band on the back. You can actually read the text on this thing. It says made in China, Hello Kitty by Sanrio. And I love the little detail here. There's like that little thing that they put in so that you can hang it on like the rack. I wonder, okay, should I take it off? No, I don't want to. I like it like how it is. It's really cute. Wait, this looks like the one I have. <laughs> yes, it's exactly the same. <laughs> oh my gosh. We're off to a good start. Mini brands, I'm impressed. On the second day of Christmas, Zuru gave, Zuru gave to me. Three, two, what is this? Whoa! It is a My Little Pony. Is this Applejack? It is Applejack. It's a My Little Pony little figurine. Oh, it's so cute. I love My Little Pony. I should get more into like the new show though. I only know like Twilight Sparkle and Applejack, but that's all I know. This one's so cute. I would totally open this up. Third day. Where is it? Oh, right there. Right here, right here, right here. Day number three. Which toy are we gonna get today? Three, two, one. Ooh, okay, this is a box. Cards Against Humanity, the absurd box. Is there cards in here? I don't think so. Oh. It is paper! They put paper in here. Cute. Number four, number four, right here. Some mini brands are good, a lot of them, but then sometimes you just get like a cardboard box and that's what I don't like about mini brands because like, I don't know, I want like something really cool every time. Ah! It's Pinkie Pie. Oh my gosh, this one's so cute. Yay, oh my gosh, what if I get like the whole collection? These are so well made. You can see Pinkie Pie right there and then her cute little face right there. Oh my gosh, I love these. Okay, my little pony. What number am I on? This like layout is so weird because it's not in order. Five, five right here. Three, two, one. <laughs> what is, is this another box? Ooh, I see these at the store all the time. It's the, um, it's a fidget. So it's like a ball and it's really squishy. It's called a Neato. Oh, I'm gonna open it and see if I can actually- I don't think I can actually squish it. Every time I see this at the store, I'm like, want to take it out of the box so bad, but I can't. I, I'd, I'd have to buy it. Okay, it's not squishy though, but I do like the detail of it being inside the box because this is what it actually looks like at the store. That's so cool. I'm gonna get one of these. Is that it? <laughs> is this called a Neato though? 
because I remember just feeling this at the store and being like, wow, this is great. This is amazing. This is my favorite fidget. So look, there's like stuff in it. There's like phloem. I kind of want to pop this one day just to see like what's actually in here. Thanks for reminding me. I was looking for that. Sixth day of Christmas. By <laughs> I just go out of order. Six. Whoa, we got all ah, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. This one's really cute. I feel like the toy mini brands are probably the best mini brands you can get because they actually like have stuff in them. I did not like food mini brands. I'm sorry. I just did not like getting a box every single time. It's stuck in there. I can't get them out. Wait, who did I even get? Coffee, you're the Ninja Turtle expert. Who has the orange bandana? Uh, Leonardo's blue. Leonardo's blue. So then we got Michelangelo. I like the movie. The Teenage Mutant Ninja movie was like so good. I can't get him out. I'm trying to get him out. He's stuck to the box. He's trapped. I need to save him. Yeah, he's glued in there. Six, seven, three more weeks. What is this? Whoa, what the? It is slime. I got a bucket of slime. Look at this tiny little pail. It's so cute. I don't think there's actually slime inside though. Unless <laughs> I can't open it. I tried. I know there's one channel that like takes a knife and just like and opens all of them. This is a bucket of Nickelodeon slime. It looks like it would be blue flavored. Spongy Bob. This is so cute. Eight right here. It's interesting how they put the picture, but then on the inside, it's like something totally different, which is good. I like surprises. I like being surprised. Who is this? Oh, <gasps> look, it's a Zuru Smashers. Oh my gosh. It's the Dino Island one. Oh, I like this one because the of the little dinosaur sticking out. This is so cute. I feel like this box of toy mini brands is like super updated because like most of these toys are ones that I've seen at the store already that I see like every time I go there. So this is really interesting. This is so cute. Oh, on the bottom you can see like the inside there's a hole it's hollow day number nine it is flats what the heck is, is this a book oh it is connect four it's a flat box anything inside the box anything inside i feel something oh okay so they put little tiny papers inside to like make the box more sturdy which i get you know with these game boards um can't really do much with the packaging it's just a box that's just how it looks like door number 10 get in there oh this one's pink <laughs> oh my gosh it's jojo siwa's headphones and the headphones are actually inside jojo siwa is such a businesswoman she got her own headphones she got her own bows dude these are so sick oh my gosh they looking cute on my fingy Yay! I love the detail. Jojo Siwa headphones. Woo! Do you consider this a toy? I feel like this wouldn't be a toy. This is an electronic device. That was 10. Now it's day 11. Another Nido. This one is green though. This is a green Nido this time. Let's open it up so we can see the actual Nido. Wow! It's a ball. I wish it was squishy, but it's okay. It's so cute. I like the packaging of this fidget. It's like really unique. Now I have two Nidos. Oh, this one is a swirl though. Wait, is it really? I don't see the swirl design on the ball though. Groovy glob. Color Nido change. Cute. These are so cute. We are at door number 12. I need another Hello Kitty thing. I was promised like at least three. That's what it told me. That's what the box personally told me. What is this? Oh, <gasps> what is this? It's a littlest pet shop. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. I want to open this, but if I do, I'll like totally ruin it. Oh my gosh. Littlest pet shop brings back like so many memories. I collected so many of these. I should find them. What animal is this? Okay, I'm gonna say this is a cat. Do you think it's a cat? Do you agree that it's a cat? I hope we can all agree that this is a meow meow. I haven't seen Lil's Pet Shop at the store, have you? Into the shelf you go. That was a good one. More animals, please. Door number 13. This one is a gold sticker. So maybe something special is inside. Let's open it up. Three, two, one. <gasps> Whoa, 
Oh, this one feels like an egg. It is an egg. Oh my gosh. This is a bunny corn surprise. I have not unboxed one of these yet, but I see like so many of these versions, like a mermaid corn, bunny corn, kitty corn. I feel like I need to get one and see like what it's all about. Number 14. Wow, you can't even see like a picture behind it because it's so big. Here we go. Door number 14. Ah! Oh, it's another Littlest Pet Shop. Oh my gosh. What animal is this? It seems that they come with a mystery animal or accessory inside the same packaging. What animal is this? Is it a dog? Coffee needs a closer look. It's an ambu ambiguous animal. Dog? Like a, a fancy dog. Yeah, it looks like a Shih Tzu because its hair is all up in a ponytail like that. So cute. Yay, we have two now. My collection is growing. Yay. Oh, It is now time for door number 15. Let's see what's inside. Eek. And it is a... Ooh, this one feels good. <gasps> Sorry, it is Rainbow Dash, a My Little Pony figure. Wait, I thought mine was defective. I thought she came with no eyes, but you have to like really look closely. You can see them more on the other side that she has eyes. I thought she was faceless for a second. My collection is growing. This is so cute. I love these. Oh, these are amazing. I think I just really like tiny things. Now we're on to door number 16, which is right here. Let's open this one up three two one and inside i feel another box what box is this <gasps> it's twister wait what's inside there you have to check just in case more paper we have several board games already door number 17 i can't tell how many's left because it's just like all over the place oh 17's right here it's gold as well so let's see if anything special is inside whoa <gasps> look at that oh my goodness it's spongebob's cat snail snail that meows gary this one is so well made the spongebob up here and then just like how big the figure is inside. Gary, it's your pineapple. Gary, it's your owner. Meow. Oh, here's the back. Oh, it says something about Gary on the back. Gary is SpongeBob's pet snail and confidant. He meows like a cat. He does not speak except in dreams, but SpongeBob can't understand his every sound. Meow. We're on 18. Where's 18? Can you find it before I can? <laughs> right here. I knew that. Three, two, one. <laughs> Ooh, this looks like another fake. Ah! <laughs> this one's SpongeBob. Are you making that face? I haven't seen it yet. Does he look funny? <laughs> what is going on here? Did we get caveman SpongeBob or? Uh... Oh, okay, I get it. This version is SpongeBob underpants. Not SpongeBob square pants, SpongeBob underpants. That makes more sense. Um, This is a very silly looking one. On the back, it says something about SpongeBob. It says that our star is incurably optimistic, innocent, earnest, and well-meaning about everything. He loves his job as a fry cook. He never passed his boat driving exam, so he doesn't have a license. And if things keep going as they have, he never will, except in his dreams. That is sad. I feel I think SpongeBob will get his license one day. If you keep trying, you'll, you're just eventually gonna get it. What number? 19. Door number 19. Where are you? Here. Three, two, one. Boom. Ooh, what's what is this? Oh, another littlest pet shop. What animal is this? Looks like a bird, but also it looks funny. It's a platypus. Oh, so cute. You know, we saw a platypus for the first time this year, and they are so cute cute they actually look more like otters cute otters with duck beaks now we're on 20 oh my gosh just four more days wait 20 21 22 23 five more days day number 20 three two one it's a whoa this one's big what is this this one's not a box i assumed it would be in a box but it is a i think it's a blues clues puzzle so here's the front and then here's the 
back. That's all the puzzles that you can get. This one's pretty cute. Blue's a girl, isn't she? I think Magenta's a boy. Wait, no, they're both girls. Wait, I don't know. Now I need to find out. Blue for sure is a girl though. 21. Door number 21. Ooh, on the it says like there's Piggy. But I don't know if there's actually Piggy, but we'll see. 21, go. 3, 2, 1, go. Ooh, we got a Power Ranger. We got Pink Ranger. Pink Ranger was my favorite when I was little. This is so cute. Urgh, it's stuck in there. Yeah. Yeah, it's stuck in there. Ooh, and then you can see all the Power Rangers on the side. That is so cool. 22. Door number 22. It is yellow gold. Let's see if it's special. I want more Hello Kitty though. Please, Hello Kitty. More Hello Kitty, please. What is this? Oh, I got a Tamagotchi. Whoa, this is cute. Oh, this is so cool. Wow. And it's pink and blue. I love Tamagotchis, except they get really annoying because then they just beep at you like, feed me, feed me. Like they need to be fed every hour of every day. 20th anniversary. Oh, in the back. I like the back a lot. It shows like what the Tamagotchi can look like. I want to take it out. No, don't, don't take it out. Leave it in the packaging. For some reason, the Tamagotchis I had as a kid were like knockoffs. I never had like the actual Tamagotchi. I just had like this dog. 20 three this one right here boom oh my gosh after this there's only one more what was this how weird is this i got mini brands in in a mini brands <laughs> this time this one is um it looks like it's like foods a whole mix of stuff it's like a collector's case i wish i can open it and see even more mini mini brands inside this is so funny last door who's excited me me i'm excited let's open it three two one last door Whoa, what's that? What is this? What is- What is this? Look at the back! This is called an angel high. Whoa, this one's insane. I have never seen these at the store. If I did, I- I want one. There's 10 surprises inside. There she is, looking all cute through the window. Just this ball alone is so cute. Is this also- This is also by Zuru. Zuru, bring these back. Like, I want it. Oh, I love this packaging. So pretty. That was a good mix of stuff, you guys. I'm really happy with what we got. I think this one is my favorite advent calendar out of the ones that we've done so far. I'm so glad that we actually got a Hello Kitty item. Even though I was expecting more, I'm still happy with all the My Little Ponies we got, the little pet shop we got, and I'm also happy that we didn't get that many cardboard boxes. And if you like this video, the next advent calendar we're doing is the Mini Brands Disney Store Edition. So click right here if you want to go and see that video, and I'll see you there. Bye!